What's going on, Vinyl Community? Welcome to another Sunboxing with the Record Spinner. In today's episode, I'm going to be doing an unboxing of Led Zeppelin's Mothership. This is a 4LP collection of the very best of Led Zeppelin. Now, I understand with compilations, it can be a bit of a mixed bag, you know, with certain songs not appearing on them, some songs appearing on them for weird reasons. But I think in the case of Mothership, um, this is a perfect compilation. And we have seen a couple of Led Zeppelin compilations come out over the years. We've had the Remasters compilation from the early 90s. We've had the early and later days albums and then we have this and to be honest all of those compilations have been the same more or less in terms of the track selection but i think they nailed it on mothership with just the way that it flows and it pretty much tells a story because if you're looking to get you know zeppelin's legacy onto four lps or two cds this is the collection for you so enough of the chit chat let's jump into what this video is all about and just like so i will be switching angles Okay, so here is the front of the box itself, which has a very nice sort of embossed spot varnish finish to it, which is very cool. And here is the spine when it's faced out on your vinyl storage cube. And then on the back of the box, we have the swan song Icarus icon there, which is really cool. But when the album is in the shrink wrap, it also comes with this little spec sheet, which breaks down the track list of the compilation has a pretty cool band photo and the box opens up just like this and inside I placed the hype sticker which you can see uh, and this particular version uses the new 2014 2015 96 24 bit masters so this is actually a second edition because the first one that came out in 2007 used a different mastering which was I don't know kind of questionable whereas this is just slightly better Yes, it is digital, but we're not going to get into that debate. Uh, right off the bat, um, the box itself comes with this little ribbon that lifts off the contents of the box, which is a nice touch. And first up, we have a nice little booklet, which opens up like this. And we have a little history write-up of Zeppelin by David Frick at uh, Rolling Stone magazine. And we have some pretty cool band photographs, as well as the individual members cool picture of uh jimmy page's guitars and then we have credits for all of the songs where they were recorded which album they appeared on what were released as singles in america and then we have some individual band photographs with a red tinge to it to kind of tie in with the color scheme of the compilation which is very nice then we have the band members names listed along with a cool live shot and then here is the blimp. So very nice booklet overall. And the first LP that we have here is the Jimmy Page LP. There he is right there. And here's the track list. So on side one, we have a good smattering of Led Zeppelin one. We have Good Times, Bad Times, Communication Breakdown, Days to Confuse, and Babe, I'm Gonna Leave You. Then on side two, we have Whole Lot of Love, Ramble On, and Heartbreaker from Led Zeppelin two. Uh, as well as the Immigrant Song from Led Zeppelin 3. All the records come in these uh, PVC inner sleeves, which are very deluxe and quite rigid in a good way. And here is the vinyl. So we have nice uh, custom labels with the band member symbols there. So it says Zoso on this side. And then we have the track lists for both of the sides here. And as you can see, probably in the dead wax, this etching indicates that it was pressed at RTI, and this etching here indicates that it was mastered by John Davis at Metropolis Mastering. And also, just side note, um, any record that comes in this kind of PVC sleeve is a good indicator that, uh, that the record was pressed to RTI, because you don't really see too many releases come in these kind of sleeves. However, they are available uh, for sale online. And then here is the second LP. John Paul Jones appears on this one. And on side three, we have Since I've Been Loving You, which is off of Led Zeppelin 3. Uh, Rock and Roll and Black Dog. Then we go on to side four with When the Levee Breaks and Stairway to Heaven. Those four tracks being on Led Zeppelin 4. And then it ends with The Song Remains the Same uh, from Houses of the Holy. There's the 
label there. And then there's the track list on that one. And then we'll move on to the third LP. This one features the late, great John Bonham. Then here's the track list. So on side five, we have uh, basically stuff all from uh, Houses of the Holy with Over the Hills and Far Away, Jamaica and No Quarter. And then on side six, we have material from Physical Graffiti with uh, Trampled Underfoot, Houses of the Holy and Cashmere. There's a Bonham's Three Rings symbol. And then here is the track list. And then we'll get to the final LP. Let's put this back in the sleeve. And here is the last one. There's Robert Plant there. And on side seven, we have material from uh, Presence. We have Nobody's Fault But Mind and the uh, epic Achilles' Last Stand. And then on side eight, we have In the Evening and All My Love from In Through the Outdoor. Uh, no material from Coda, no unreleased extras. It's just all stuff from the main studio discography, which I think is justifiably so. It's quite fair to do it that way. There's Robert Plant's symbol there and then we have the track lists here on the label just like that very nice indeed and very beautifully designed i love the layout of this entire set and the way how uh, the individual sleeves are designed as well as the um the center labels for the records it's just all done very very nicely So there you go. That is the box set. So there you guys go. That is my unboxing of Led Zeppelin's Mothership. If you enjoyed this video, please go ahead, give it a like, subscribe to the channel. And if you want to support this channel, be sure to check me out on Patreon. See you guys in the next video. And most importantly, keep the records spinning.